Whoa! All right, it has been a while since I've made a YouTube video, but I am back with this one. Slightly different than before, uh, but no less informative and, I'm gonna say, instrumental to your health, fitness, strength, just everything. You can probably tell from the title, it is super easy. So I'm gonna show you how I made a pull-up bar. Right behind me here in my backyard, it took about an hour. Budget was pretty good. I'm gonna show you how I made it with the simple steps. All right, so firstly, I had to dig two holes. I started off digging one hole though at 600 mil depth. Now that was just because I'm six foot four tall and I'm using posts that are 3.6 meters long. So we figured to make it sturdy and so it didn't wobble, digging them into about 600 mils in the ground was the best way to go. Once I have dug one of the holes at 600 mil, I am using five bags per hole of quick set concrete. So I'm slowly mixing one bag at a time, filling the hole, making sure the post is setting up level as well. Once that is level, I measure the width of the bar too, knowing that the bar is 1.2 meters or 1200 mil wide. I start digging the second hole 1.2 meters away, allowing for it to be inbuilt into the bar a fraction. As you can see, we're using a spade bit on the drill. That bit is gonna hollow out the hole of the post so the bar can fit in nice and snug. Now my bar is 25 mil in diameter and allowing for a little bit of outer thickness and threading of the bar. We only had a 25 mil spade bit so you can see that we are boring it out a little bit extra here. Wriggle it around, make sure it is a tight fit once you've got the bar in. If you need to bore it out a little bit more like we did, you just go that little bit extra at each time until you have the perfect width. Not a big issue if it's a little bit too big as ours was because we just filled the gaps with ready nails or, or glue. You can use super glue, anything to help pack it out. Once we've worked out the width, then we start putting the post in that second hole, making sure it's square using the leveler that everything is nice and straight, and then repeating the process, five bags of concrete, mixing one bag at a time. The bar is up, check that it is all straight. We have filled the holes with some liquid nails just to get that little bit extra sturdiness of the bar so it doesn't move in the holes. Mixing through the bags until all five bags are done. And then we are gonna have our pull-up bar. It doesn't take long. The total budget for this cost me about $300, including the posts, the bar, uh, and the liquid nails. We are ready to go. All right, there you have our pull-up bar. As I said, it took about an hour. It cost around $300 to build, $300 Australian dollars to build. I chose to use posts that are 3.6 uh, meters in length and 90 mil in diameter, and they were the more expensive posts as well. I'm using a timber called Merbau and their finger joint as well. So it is cheaper, you can go even cheaper if you use a hardwood or even a cypress pine as well. I know you can get those posts in. Again, I used 3.6 meters high in the posts and I had the bar at about 2.6 meters um, from the ground because I am 190 centimeters, 1.9 meters tall, plus my arms. I always wanna hang and have that little bit extra under my feet so I can dead hang. So we put the bar, we measured, myself standing up so what you can do you can stand up stretch your arms out nice and tall see what your highest point is if you're off the ground and then uh, slot the bar in from there so I did my bar at about 2.6 meters again all up 300 Australian dollars approximately about an hour and a bit work and now I have a pull-up bar so if you're wanting to build one that's how easy it is go get it done and then you'll get the pull-up game